This is Lisa from Mobile Tech Review and today we're going to take a look at a new Twitter application for Android smartphones. It's called Tweetcaster by Handmark. It should be out by the end of January. We're going to test it on the Nexus One but this should work on any Android phone. It has the crazy bluebird icon here. And here it is. So you can see the UI is more sophisticated and attractive looking than any Twitter app we've seen, even Twidroid and Swift, which are both pretty good tweet, tweet apps on uh, Android. This is your initial tweet timeline view right here, with the bubbles for each tweet, pictures, it's quite fast. One of the options that we like is you can hit the jump to top to go to the top. I know when I use Swift often I have to scroll forever to get to the newest tweets that are on my phone. You can look at your replies here, color-coded, your direct messages. If you have favorites, they'll show up here, and if you're subscribing to any Twitter lists, they'll be here. And if you want to tweet, just hit the pencil right there and start tweeting away. It also works in landscape mode which makes it easier to use the on-screen keyboard when you're tweeting. You get the bigger version of the keyboard there. And that means obviously you can use it with something like the Motorola Droid with the keyboards, slide it out. We've got quite a few settings here. This supports multiple Twitter accounts. URL shortening services, image services. You can set the auto-refresh interval right here. Anything from as often as 30 seconds if you really want to kill your battery, all the way up to 30 minutes. Change the font size, URL handling, you can have it automatically open URLs, ask you what to do, or copy URLs. And you can set background notifications, as well as choosing your theme. So that's Tweetcaster by Handmark. It should be available again by the end of January for Android phones. And I'm Lisa from Mobile Tech Review. Visit our website to read the full write-up.